Hello everyone and welcome back. So today I have a collective haul for you. I just ran out. It's Friday evening and I did my grocery and a little bit of like stuff shopping as my husband calls it. He says I always need more stuff. And so I went out today just really fast to get everything done so I can be home for the weekend. Get like an agenda together and stick to it so I can hopefully get some things done. I look like a mess. I know. Like I got out the shower, washed my hair, blow dried it, went to school for like a little study group and went straight shopping for the weekend. But I'm going to try to do the grocery part really fast because I want to get everything into the fridge just so y'all can see everything I've got. I have a ton of hauls, you guys, that I've done like over Black Friday and stuff. Not a ton of hauls, but like a couple of hauls that were really big. And as you can hear my coffee machine back there, see that little blue light? Yeah, I bought a new like coffee machine for Black Friday. Got to get a Keurig just because I don't have a favorite like coffee just yet. And I really need to learn. Um, like before I, I invest in a, and Keurig isn't even like the highest end of coffee makers, to be honest. But before I invest in something like that, I really want to do my research to know, like, because some of them are only designed for K-cups. Sometimes I like a fresh ground coffee, and I'm not going to buy a coffee machine that I can't still use fresh ground coffee, because it's just fresher. It tastes better. So anyway, speaking of coffee, let me get this all going. So I got some um, half and half, and this is just organic valley. This this is from Sprout, so I'll tell you when I stop. There's a, like a farmer's market that we have here called Sprouts, and I like to get a lot of my produce and stuff from there. It's a little bit cheaper than Whole Foods. Um, so I do go there quite often. Anyway, so what I was saying about like Black Friday and stuff, I have a lot of hauls, you guys, that I just I haven't been able to get posted. I have some, like, I will, not some stuff. I have one thing from Ikea that I bought. The coffee machine that you just heard. Like, we have a lot, like, and I have a huge Dollar Tree that, like, I recorded, but it was from two different trips. Like, I went, and then I went back the next day because the, the truck had come to see, like, if they had any of the other things that I wanted. And they did, and I ended up spending, like, some more money. So, it was probably, like, a $100 haul. But, um... I haven't had time like to combine the videos, edit it, and all that stuff. And by the time that you know I get around to that, it's gonna be like, what's the point? You know, everybody's already seen it. Blase, blase. What's the point? You know, like. But if you follow me on Instagram, you see some of the stuff that I've posted. Most of that's in my haul. I did find the Aladdin cups, but I didn't find the lids and the straws. Um, and I found some different Aladdin cups than what everybody else was hauling, but I haven't got to. Um, post those, like a do a video for them, but like I said, by the time I get to a point where I can actually do that because of the way I did the video, it's going to be pointless because I'm going to have to combine two videos, like upload two videos, combine them, and then edit out so you can know like what's going on because they're so like all over the place. Anywho, half and half, have to have this. I got a bell pepper, an avocado, one regular tomato, one cucumber, a bag of baby carrots, a bag of, um, what are these called, like cherry tomatoes, yum. Um, I'm definitely going to try to start eating healthier right now because I do have my surgery date. It's going to be January 10th as of now. If they're able to work me in sooner before like the year's over, they will do that. But as of now, it's not going to happen and it sucks. But at least I will be in with at least a week's worth of recovery before my spring semester starts. We got some organic baby spinach. So I'm definitely going to be doing like some cleanses and stuff like that so I can kickstart after my, after my surgery. My brand new diet. We got some eggs. 
Because you guys, like, I was like eating so horribly bad because I was like, it's my thyroid. It's nothing's gonna work. I'm just gonna gain weight. There's nothing I can do about it. If it's a thyroid problem, what can be done? You know? So like, I just went crazy. Let's The weight packed on and it packed on and it packed on. So now you don't have to like, take care of that. So anywho, that is all from sprouts that I got. Because I have like chicken and fish and stuff like that at home. So I didn't need to get any meats. However, I did get some. Uh, so the next bag is from Target. Got some bananas. Turkey Franks, um, I got these like for breakfast in the morning or if I want a hot dog or something, I did get these. I like these with my eggs so in the morning, like if I make an omelet, I'll eat, like I'll slice it in half and then like grill it really a lot. We got some milk and I got some of this Christmas washies. Looks like they had restocked the entire um, like little dollar bin of Christmas stuff, which I thought was very. I got some Brussels sprouts. I got some cheese and broccoli, or well, broccoli and cheese sauce. These were on sale for 99 cents, so I got two of those. That's, oh, and a can of petite diced tomato. <laughs> so, I don't know about you guys, but Christmas is kind of like taking all my money. <laughs> not really. Christmas is not taking all my money. But I went to the post office, um... Earlier this week, I don't remember exact date, but I went to the post office earlier this week um, because I needed some uh, packages and get like check on their uh, flat rate boxes, right? So the smallest box, shoot, and I left them upstairs. The smallest box is like seriously, you guys, like this big and this deep, and um. $7.99 and what can you fit in there, right? Okay, so then the medium size box is much larger for $17.99, I believe, is what he told me. And it's really, really big. And I don't like that's I don't know if that's normal. Like the the postage rates go up for the holidays. Like I don't really know because I don't really send out like flat rate packages that much, but I need to find that out, like, that would be just good FYI, but, um, so yeah, I had some packages scheduled to go out this weekend that may or may not go out, just because if I'm going to spend $18 for a flat rate package, then I'm going to put as much stuff in there as I can, you know, I'm not, like, what I had in mind to send out was not... Like, it wouldn't have, have fit in the smallest one at all. Like, there was no way. But the one size up was, like, um, I still had a, a lot of room. And I wasn't going to spend $18, you know. What, and I'm going to take as much advantage of that as I can, if that makes sense. But what I will do is go tomorrow and see, like, what I do have, like how much it weighs um, by itself, like in another package. And if it's still like pretty close to, you know, the 18 bucks, then I'm just going to go the other way and just pack it all in there. So there's that. <laughs> Next place I went to is the Dollar Tree, of course. My Target and my Dollar Tree are... Actually, all of these stores were, like, right here, like, in a little triangle. 
one um, complex is like across the street, but then there's the Target. And, and I also stopped at Tuesday morning. I only got two things from there. I paid like 60 cents in there. That's it. They didn't really have much. I was actually going in there to see if they had any more of the mistletoe kiss and stuff, and they were out. So I got one thing of paper towels. I got one thing of toilet paper. I did pick up some apple cider, and this is where I went wrong, you guys, because it is now 7:47. Like, um, I haven't eaten since one o'clock this afternoon, and I was starving. So, like, I did really good. I got greens and veggies and, you know, nothing. No chips, no rice, no bread, no nothing, right? And then, like, it's 7.30, and I was, like, just starving. So I started throwing, like, chips and cookies <laughs> and stuff in my bag, and it, it got, like, really bad. You know, I started out reading labels and <laughs> all kinds of, don't go to the store hungry. That is the moral of the story. But I did get some of this apple cider juice. Um, it's not the greatest. It's 18 grams of sugar, 18 grams of carbs, or a 8-ounce serving. But I really wanted this. It's really good. I had some at my in-law's house um, for Thanksgiving, so I like, had to have it. So y'all want to try it out? So then next thing I got from Dollar Tree was and these are new items I believe like I haven't seen anybody haul them and I've never seen them in there before. So they had some suddenly pasta in the Chipotle ranch which this looks really good. So I picked up two of these and I think I'm really gonna like these. I love black beans and then the Chipotle ranch is really good. This is not healthy. This is not great. Like, this will be, like, probably my one bad meal for a week. That is my goal. It has 2 grams of sugar, 31 grams of carbs, and a um, 2 third cup. No, 3 fourths cup if it's prepared. So, yeah, that this will be, like, my, my bad day. Next, they had... Some grown uh, the Bear Creek's macaroni and cheese. This one is creamy chipotle as well. So I like I, I couldn't leave it there. <laughs> I got two of these again. Like I love creamy chipotle ranchy stuff. It's so good. And I, I've been hearing a lot of this Bear Creek, and they did have the beer and mac, and I just I can't do it. <laughs> I don't even want to think about. How beer and macaroni can go together. So I left those on the shelf for someone else, but I did get these when I seen them. Grown up mac and cheese, creamy chipotle. So then I got a bonus pack of sponges because we were out. And I, well, we're not out, but um, almost out. And they had the bonus pack. So. Finally. This Bella Shore has these, so I got one package. I was trying to get two, but I controlled myself because I'm really only getting it for this truck right here. But I, I can totally use the rest of this stuff. I just, um, that was my main goal with this truck. So I only got one. I got some lemon cookies. This is one of the things that, like, I started throwing, like, I was getting hungry and I was like I need this and then I also got the old-fashioned home style select kettle cooked barbecue chips as you can see okay so then that's what I did you guys I got some pickles these are the sandwich sliced pickles I love pickles, and pickles are not bad for you. One gram of carbs, zero grams of sugar. That's what I'm looking at is carbs and sugar. I'm not looking at calories. And Next thing I got was some chickpeas, and I got two cans of these. 
those are like my favorites. Two cans of those. And I totally, like, normally, um, get dry ones. And I, um, like, make them up myself. But sometimes I don't have time, and these are great to have. And, um, what else was I going to say? I don't have any on hand, and I'm not going to where I, like, I normally go to a certain store to get those. In a, a really big bag for way cheaper than any grocery store. So, I got two of these for me for the week. These are great. You can roast them. You can put them in salads. You can. I like to just season them and eat them. Like they're like I love chickpeas. You can make hummus. You can make whatever. So because of this um this thing. I went ahead and got some white chicken from Dollar Tree. I've never, like, I don't know. I just got it to go in, in one of those salads. Next thing I got was some chunk white albacore tuna that they had. Like, I was surprised to see this at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. So I picked up two. I had, like, only one line of those, and the rest was the other kind of tunas. But I picked those up. Also, I picked up some salsa. I love to make my own, but I like to have this on hand, and it's a gluten-free product. Um, there's kind of, there's two grams of sugar and two grams of carbs. It's kind of a lot, you know, considering, like, if you make it your own, how how much better it is. But salsa is really good for you. Um, and I love to eat it on eggs and stuff in the morning. If I make an omelet, I like to have, like, my eggs, my salsa, my weenie. <laughs> Okay, so the last thing I found was a really great deal, and I got these, like I said, um, for a friend now, and also one for myself. So I got this 1,000 pieces, like my Dollar Tree had a ton of these, um, like sticker value packs, whatever you want to call them. So this is over 1,000 pieces, and I thought this was just super cute here. And I got two of those. And then I got this one here that has, um, like, just really cute stuff. But yeah, these are really cute. And for a dollar, a thousand pieces of stickers, there's three, six, nine, nine rolls of stickers in here. I cannot beat it. So I got these. Like, I wanted to, like, just throw them all in my box, but that's the point, right? <laughs> Anyways, you guys, um, thank you all for watching. I hope that you like this video. hope that you find some stuff that you can add to your wish list. And thank you all for watching. Bye.